Durf. He's been on his bully, you know what I'm saying, since, you know what I mean? He battled John John. He's been on his bully. You know what I'm saying? And he's a man of his word. He said if JC win the motherfucking tournament and bring him, bring bring home that money, I will give that nigga an opportunity to motherfucking have a conversation with me. You know what I'm saying? And you know what I mean? JC, you know what I'm saying? Wanted to battle so bad he ran through the tournament. That's real. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to JC. You know what I'm saying? One of the illest pens in the game. You know what I mean? He definitely showed up. And, um, yeah, that shit is going down. JC versus Sue Surf, September 24th. You know what I mean? Charlotte, North Carolina, Club World, URL TV, Summer Madness. Let's talk about it, man. This is going to be a crazy battle. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to keep it a buck. This is going to be a crazy, crazy, crazy battle. You got Sue Surf. You got JC. You know what I'm saying? These niggas, like, it's not a grudge match, but within itself, it is a grudge match because Sue Surf talks so much shit. This nigga is like a boxer analyst. This nigga just, when he start talking, he cannot stop. You know what I'm saying? And JC, on the other hand, he been feeling disrespected. JC is like, I haven't been getting what I deserve. This nigga was battling everywhere. He was battling in the subway in New York. This nigga was battling down the block from his crib. This nigga was battling in the backyard in the garage. But throughout all those battles, you know what I'm saying, he have won a lot of those battles. I don't know a lot of niggas that beat JC Pauls, you know what I'm saying? But like Sue Surf put a list out. And this nigga put a list out and says, where is the top tiers on the list that you beat and you went 15-0 and 0 on the app? And I get it, bro, you know what I'm saying? But a lot of those people on that list was like Swamp was on a crazy mean run. You know what I'm saying? Fonz, he was top punch in the game. Nitty, number two, number one punch in the game. So, the, like, the niggas who he beat had to actually go through other niggas. So, it's like he actually beat them too. It's kind of like he took the soul of those niggas because he beat that nigga. You know what I'm saying? If you understand what I'm saying. But Sue Surf, this nigga is just like, he said gun titles run battle rap. I seen your hip hop is real interview. You said gun titles run battle rap. And I get it. Yeah, with the numbers, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, but it's a lot of other areas, performance, you know what I'm saying? Like believability. You know what I'm saying? Y'all got all that. You know what I'm saying? But it's like other areas in battle rap that y'all don't run. With the numbers, y'all run that. Tay Rock, top, you know what I'm saying, chess, easy. You know what I'm saying? I get it. You know what I'm saying? So it's 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 a numbers game and y'all niggas running the numbers and, and Sue Surf is just gonna throw that out there every time. This nigga ran through New Jersey twerk, this nigga ran through John John the Don. This nigga, you know what I'm saying? He was on his run. You know what I'm saying? He was on his bully. I'm gonna keep it the buck. This nigga was just twelve rounds. It was like, yo, I'm 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 three and oh, I'm six and oh, I'm twelve and you know what I'm saying, I ain't lost a round yet. You know what I'm saying? So it's like He'd been coming with three. It's like before then, he was only having two. And niggas was like, yo, at least you'll get the third. You know what I'm saying? Because you already know. But it's like now, it's like he's coming with all three of them things. Chef Trez in that. You know what I'm saying? Like this nigga's really on, on his bully. And I feel like this battle, it had to happen. You know what I'm saying? Because JC actually won that money. You know what I'm saying? Now, Sue Surf. You know what I'm saying? Not only JC can actually talk money with you because he just won that 120. You know what I'm saying? He can actually still bar you at the same time. You know what I'm saying? So the money thing, the money angle that you're trying to come at with JC, it might not work. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like you're going to have to actually rap. You're going to actually have to rap with those three. You're actually really going to have to rap. And I, I know Circle come out there because your last battle with the, uh, with the Hot 97 shit going on, the comparison... Don't come in here with any type of balls like that. We know it's going to be electrifying. It's it's not a home game for neither one of y'all niggas. You know, it ain't in Jersey. It ain't in, uh, you know what I'm saying, the uh, Midwest. So neither one of y'all have an advantage. Both of y'all going to have to come out here and rap. And I think this battle right here is actually more anticipated kind of than the Cortez joint. You know what I'm saying? Because like it was like steam was built up to the Cortez joint. And then it's like. It didn't happen, and then it had to be rescheduled, so it's like it kind of lost some momentum, you know what I'm saying? So it's like now this battle is actually going to happen, and you know what I'm saying? It's going to happen on the day it's supposed to happen, so I feel like this is more kind of anticipated because it's a more of a bar fest, you know what I'm saying? You and Cortez was like that grudge match, 
back in the day. You wanted to have this conversation with him. You know what I'm saying? Now JC is just like, yo, you the you you the end game of my era. You know what I'm saying? Like JC finally get to walk down that that road with you. You know what I'm saying? He get to put that hoodie on and have that talk. You know what I'm saying? So that's kind of what this is like. You know what I'm saying? But JC, you got a lot to prove, my nigga. I'm going to keep it real. JC, you have a lot to prove. And if you go in there and win this battle, you're going to have to take the first round. And I don't see that happening. So, sir, do not lose first rounds. This nigga come out there and he get the crowd electrified. They have the, he got the white tee on. He's, he's going to have the crowd involved. He's going to bring the bars back. And have them say it with them. Like, it's just, that's the energy. You know what I'm saying? Like, so, I don't know how you're going to win this battle, JC, if you don't have a undeniable first round. Your first round had to be one of them ones. Because we know surf rounds will be one of them ones. So, it's going to have to be a classic. Right there off the rip, it's going to have to be a classic. You, you got to come out the gate swinging. You cannot play defense against Sue Surf in a... A, a bat in a, a battle like this, you cannot you cannot play defense. You got to come out swinging offense. You got to come out with haymakers, especially if you go first. That'll kind of steal some of the energy out of the room. If you know what I'm saying, depending on who go first. Like in this match right here, it's like who goes first is gonna set the tone of the battle. You know what I'm saying? And I know it's always the third round who hurt last, but in this battle, it's like if you set the tone. It's 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 gonna be crazy. It's gonna be a long night for the person who stand on the other side of those rhymes. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna keep it a buck. And Sue Surf, he actually has some fire shit, man. It's just you ain't heard a mixtape from Surf lately. He he been on his battle rap shit. You know what I'm saying? He's just been like, you know what I'm saying? Going around promoting different matches. You know what I'm saying? Evidently, he got a contract with the URL, so he locked in with them. It's kind of like he he get paid to. And be an analyst and battle rap, so it's just like, why drop mixtapes when you're doing this over here on it? So I get it, but this battle is gonna be crazy because we all know what happened prior to his, you know what I'm saying, 12 and 0, whatever, 13, 15 and 0. We seen what happened prior to that. This man was out there, he was out there struggling, you know what I'm saying? He wasn't looking too good on the court. You know what I'm saying? Like his knees was looking real weary, you know what I'm saying? But Kyrie bounced back. He came back to play. So we go see what's gonna happen in this battle. But if I had to choose, I, I, I surf got to come with that. That first surf, the second JC probably go steal that second, and the third is gonna be like up in the air. You know what I'm saying? Like JC normally have solid thirds because if Swamp, if Swamp would not have stumbled in that third, I feel like JC would have lost. He would have lost the tournament. And then surf the surf battle would have been out, but it actually didn't have like that. So, but if I had to choose, I feel like I got surf winning this battle. You know what I'm saying? But keep it real. Anyways, the homie the election. Until the next time, man, subscribe. We out, you heard?